Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to a long awaited another episode of John's Rant. This is episode 15 and we're talking Path of the Warrior DLC, the final DLC for WWE 2K15. You guys, I do apologize for the long absence for YouTube, but it is a good reasoning why I've been absent from YouTube, but we'll get into that a little bit later in the rant. Uh, before we get started, ladies and gentlemen, I cannot do John's rant without my trusty partner, my co-host of John's rant. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back Caesar. What is up, man? What's going on, dude? Really? <laughs> Welcome back, man. It seems like for ages, dude, that we have done this. We haven't done this, actually. Right. Oh, my God, man. How you been, though, man? How you been? Good. Just, just been going to my classes. That's what's up, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, Caesar is in college now, man. So that's kind of another reason why John's rent has been freaking absent for almost a month. Not only that, my job, you guys, I'm working like crazy. Not only that, I do have a Twitch account now, by the way, that you guys should really consider following me on Twitch. I'm on the road to 200. Also, by a great surprise. We're on the road to freaking 500 subscribers right here on YouTube, Caesar. Can you believe that, man? We're almost there. We're like at, what, 426, 427 right now, give or take. You're right. So, you guys, I mean, even though I have been MIA, Caesar has been MIA, you guys are still clicking that subscribe button, and that's what counts. Thank you guys so much. But, without further ado, you guys are here because y'all want to know what me and Caesar thought about Path of the Warrior. Now, if you guys don't know, this past Tuesday, 2K released the final expansion for the 2K Showcase, the long-awaited Path of the Warrior DLC, man. Alright, but anyway, we're going to start off by telling you what the Path of the Warrior is. Basically, Path of the Warrior starts off with his victory over the Honky Tonk Man in 1988 SummerSlam. Other bouts featured in the content including Face Off with Hulk Hogan, Andre the Giant, Sergeant Slaughter, Randy, Macho Man Savage, and Colonel Mustafa, and others. Oh, if you guys did not have a chance to catch out my live stream, I did Tuesday. The, the same day the Path of the Warrior came out, shame on you. I did a live stream of Path of the Warrior. People came out. We had fun. We talked WWE, WrestleMania 31. We talked about the Hall of Fame. We talked about Ultimate Warrior. And matter of fact, you guys, we do have a rant coming on WrestleMania 31. So please stay tuned. We got a lot coming. We got to get caught up on a lot. But it's coming in all due time, I promise you. Caesar, what did you think? I know you have not quite finished playing the Ultimate War, the Path of the Warrior yet. But from what you have played thus far, man, what do you think? Um, like, some stuff, I'm mad that you couldn't play, like, like, you just press one button and it's over, and I was like, okay, but so far, besides that, I'm still liking it. Right, I mean, like, when I first started off the Path of the War, you guys, I'm not going to lie to you, I'm not going to front at all. The the it like the video package the intro to Path of the Warrior is freaking phenomenal. It's awesome. It's awesome. It's awesome. I'm I'm not going I'm not going to bull jive you. It's freaking awesome what they did here. I mean even the ending. I'm not even going to give a freaking ending away because it would not be fair for the ones that did not play it yet. But understand this. Even Caesar hasn't gotten to the ending yet, so I'm not going to give it away to him either because it wouldn't be fair. The ending to the Path of the Warrior, hey, hey. I can tell it's going to be amazing. It's sweet, yes, it's sweet. I'm not even going to give it to you. I'm not even going to tell you what it is and just have you watch it because it wouldn't be fair. Like I said, even if Caesar did finish playing the Path of the Warrior, you know, I know he got a lot going on just like I do, I still wouldn't give it away here in this rant because it would not be fair to my subscriber and to my Soon be subscribers. If you guys have not yet subscribed, please consider hitting that subscribe button for me so we can get to 500. 
uh, plus subscribers right here in the best of both worlds. But you guys, the path of the warrior from from beginning to end is awesome. Now, here's the deal. When I first downloaded Path of the Warrior, it was freakishly long to download. It really was. I, it took me a few hours to like download it, so I had to go do other things on, on, on PlayStation 4. But when I finally got it, I was happy with it. Now, when you first download this thing, you're going to say, what the hell? Eight matches. That's all you get is eight. But I tell you this much. The history that they bring you into this thing is out there. I mean, yeah, I wanted a little bit more. I think they could have went with 19, like they did with John Cena and CM Punk, uh, uh, loyalty, hustle, and disrespect. If I'm saying that incorrect, I do apologize, yeah, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Better, but right, it's still I, good. right. I wish it was a little bit longer on that aspect, but it's still good. I'm telling you, it's still good. Now, this content that we're talking about, Path of the Warrior, is available on the Xbox One. Xbox 360, PlayStation 4, and PlayStation 3. And you also get a full round of everything included with the Path of the Warrior, courtesy of 2K Sports. And this is what I'm talking about. We're going to go down a little laundry list of everything that comes with the Path of the Warrior. So basically, you're gonna the story is focused on the career of the WWE Hall of Famer, Ultimate Warrior. You get playable WWE Hall of Famers, including the Ultimate Warrior, from 1989 to 1996, Hulk Hogan from 1990, Andre the Giant from 1988, and Sergeant Slaughter from 1991. You also get playable WWE Legends Honky Tonk Man from 1988, Rick Rude from 1990, Randy Macho Man Savage from 1991, and Colonel Mustafa from 1991. Also, now, that's a lot. Now, you guys, I just read off one, two, let me see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight guys. Right there. This one, this right now, you get eight guys right now, right off the bat with this DLC. Eight freaking guys. And I'm not even freaking done yet. Also, you get playable WWE Superstars The Undertaker from 1991. You guys. This is the Young Undertaker. I repeat, this is the Young Undertaker. I do, I do believe this is Taker at his debut in the WWF. Also, you get Hunter Hearst Hemsley from 1996. So that's eight, nine. That's roughly what? See, so there's about ten guys or so right there, give or take, man. I just mentioned. Yeah. All right. I'm not done yet, guys. You guys are, holy shit, why, John? You're not done. No, I'm not. Access to WWE Hall of Fame ring announcer Howard Finkel and WWE managers Jimmy Hart, the mouth of the South, G Jimmy Hart, Bobby the Brain Heenan, Paul Barra, uh, Sherry, Sid Justice, and General Atnan. Now, General Atnan, he's a playable character as well in the game. Why they did not mention that in the other characters, I have no idea. But he's a playable character. Also, I'm not good at Roman numerals, but you get WrestleMania, WrestleMania V1, WrestleMania V2, and X2. All right, I'm not good at Roman numerals, guys. Sorry. You get SummerSlam, 1988, 1990, and 1991. Also, Saturday night's main event, and Madison Square Garden. And for you guys that don't know, the Ultimate Warrior, a.k.a. Jim James Hillwig, died in April of 2014. Uh, I want to say, what, a couple, a few days after his induction and his final appearance on Monday Night Raw. Okay, Path of the Warrior is included, for, for the ones that don't know, is included with the $25 WWE 2K15 DLC Pass. Or you can purchase it by itself for the low, low price of $10. Now, if you guys ask me to enjoy all the DLC, including getting paid, just the only way you can get paid, you got to pay that $25 to get paid. I know it's sad, but it's true. To enjoy the Path of the Warrior and everything else included with the showcase, the better price is $25. It really is. 
And for the ones that don't know, 2K is working on a mobile game called WWE 2K. Now, I had a chance to look at some screenshots of the game. It does look like a next-gen uh, 2K15, but for so far, it's only been called WWE 2K thus far. But, in my opinion, the, author, the, the Path of the uh, Warrior DLC, in my opinion, gets a 10. It does. It gets, a, it gets a 10. You get a lot of stuff with this, guys. I mean, a lot. For $10, even just buying it by itself for $10 is still a good buy. You're getting more stuff with this than any of the other two DLCs that they leased prior to this one. Uh, Caesar, what's your take, man? I mean, I know you haven't finished playing it yet, dude, but, I mean, you got a grade or not? Nah? So far, I'll give it a, like, I'll give it a A. I'll give it an A. So he's giving it an A, I'm giving it a 10, so my 10 does rank up as an A as well, guys. And like I said, you guys, the Path of the Warrior is awesome. This is the one that I've been waiting for. Uh, I have, I've been waiting for all of them. But by far, if I had to pick just one that I like the most, it would have to be this one. And I guess it's because I'm one of those retro guys. I'm 28, you guys. And, you know, I like the retro look of wrestling. I really do. I like the retro rings and, you know, how they really didn't have those pyrotechnics back in the day. They, they didn't have all those fancy ramps and all that crap stuff. It just was a straight to the action type show. And that's what I liked about wrestling in the 80s through the 90s. So honestly, you guys, I got two thumbs up for this one. If you do not own it, please consider downloading it. You should. Path of the Warrior is where it's at. Um, Caesar, you got anything else you want to add to this rant before we close it up, man? Um, like, all right, guys. Well, you heard from Caesar. Oh, before I go, like I said, I do have a Twitch account, guys. I'm trying to do the live stream thing over on Twitch, so you can do so. Please feel free to follow me on Twitch, and that's twitch.tv forward slash true John B. That's T R U J O N B. Now, I'll make sure I put that link in the description below in this video. But you guys, like I said, I do apologize. Me and Caesar have been in my aid for the last month. We have not been doing John's rant. But we're going to try to get back into the swing and bring back John's rant. Like I said, ladies and gentlemen, we do have more coming up. We have WrestleMania 31 rant that you guys are not going to want to miss out on. I'm telling you, you're not going to want to miss out on the WrestleMania 31 rant because it's going to be explosive. It's going to be huge and it's going to be a must listen. Guaranteed. Also, guys, again, thank you guys so much for subscribing. We're on that road to 500, so make sure you consider clicking that subscribe button. Become a part of the Best of Both Worlds community. Until we chat again in the next rant, you guys, leave those comments down below what you thought of Path of the Warrior. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Thumbs up this video. Share this video with your family, with your friends, Twitter, Facebook, wherever you share your content at. I appreciate it. Hey Caesar, I am John and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.